Are you warming up? No way, no way, no way. Hey everyone, how you doing? Stop, stay home, be safe, and practice. That's what you need to be doing right now. I think this is the most important thing for a musician or a jazz musician to be doing, concentrating on this time off that they have to become a better player in person, okay? It's a tough time in this moment, but these are the days when you are out on the road and wishing you were home with the family or doing something musically to make yourself stronger. So here it is. Take advantage of it, stay strong, and help your people get through the situation. So today I wanted to give you a little something to work on regarding my triadic approach with the chromaticisms. This will keep you busy and you know aware of what's happening. I want to give you some ideas of how I look at chromaticism and how I employ the triadic approach in playing. So that was quasi chromatic approach in a non repetitive sequence. Now I would like to play that same thing quicker for you. So try to follow along if you can. I'll give you a little example of how to practice the chromatic approach with all the intervals inside of a major third, say concert C to concert E. Trying to play these ideas, the four intervals that you have and not being repetitive. So you'll do that with intervals of major thirds, not going lower than the root, higher than the major third, and playing these in random sequences all over your instrument. So then what you're going to do is I want you to be able to connect all of these major thirds and move up and down your instrument without getting larger than a major third. It's up to you to work on it slowly and make sure that it comes into your consciousness in a very relaxed state. Okay, everyone, so if you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.